Today in Minecraft, Sunny went crazy. Sunny and I found this cave, and after he disappeared for a year, he's back, but he went nuts. Oh, Melon, why don't you come out and play? Sunny keeps pulling evil pranks on me, playing spooky sounds, and even sent scary mobs to attack me on my date night. Then he placed eerie Sunny clones everywhere. I'm, I'm freaking out. It's time for you to pay the price for abandoning me. <laughs> Help! Subscribe right now, or else Sonny's gonna kill me! Bro, we've been mining for ages. Are we gonna ever find some diamonds? Bro, speak of the devil. Check it out, we've got diamonds! No way! But, uh, Melon, I don't think we should be going down here. Bro, what are you talking about, dude? It's free diamonds, bro. This looks pretty suspicious, like the diamonds are trying to trap us. What are you even talking about, bro? I've got diamonds, right? Uh, Melon? There's a warden! What the hell? Back. Hey guys, what's up? Melon? Did that warden just talk to us? Uh, Sonny, you must be imagining things. We gotta get out of here. Buddy, talk to me. I must eat you. I must eat you. No, Melon, he's trying to eat us. Ah, Melon, he wants to eat us. Run. Sonny, there's parkour. Don't mess this up or you'll be trapped here forever. He's trying to eat me. Ah, ah. Ow, I slipped. No! I'm sorry, Sonny, but I've got to save myself. No, Melon, come back! I'm sorry! Uh, hey, little buddy. Hi, I just wanted to play some tag. That was really fun. Wait a second. So you can talk? Yeah, I'm much more advanced than the other wardens and friendlier. Wait a second. You weren't trying to eat me? No, I just wanted to play tag. Bro, next time you're playing tag, be a little more gentle. You're still really strong. Oh, I'm sorry about that. I don't get many visitors down here. Well, it's nice to meet you, Warden. My name is Sunny. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Sunny. Do you want to train to become a warden like me? I must warn you, though. It's very, very rough training. But if you complete it, you'll get some cool power-ups. No way. I can train to become a strong warden like you? Yeah, but it's going to take about one year. And the only thing that worries me is most people I train end up crazy. So hopefully you're tough enough for this. Of course I'm tough enough for this. There's no way I'll go crazy. Thousands of tears later. Yes! Yes! I feel the power! It flows through me! Um, Sonny, are you okay? Yes. <laughs> yes, I'm feeling great. Better than ever, thank you. That completes your training. Here's your warden heart. And also, remember, you can use new powers like blinding people and turning invisible and some other cool stuff. You'll figure that out later. <laughs> Thank you, Warden. I'll come visit you again real soon. <laughs> oh, that melon. Oh, that melon's gonna get it. Now that I've unlocked my Warden heart and superpowers, I'm gonna... <laughs> Goats, it's been a whole year since Sonny's died, and now it's time to pay him tribute. Rest in peace, Sonny. But on the bright side, I've got the whole house to myself, and I've made some pretty good progress. Check this out. I've even got my whole hidden base. I just gotta go down here. Look at it. It's filled with loot. I'm pretty much the richest player in all of Minecraft. And you're probably wondering why it's yellow. Well, that's because it was Sunny's secret base. But then once I found it, I decided to make it mine. Plus he's dead, so who cares? Ugh, it's been a long day. Anyways, I'm gonna go check up with Quandale and see how he's doing. He's my new best friend. There it is, guys. The old house. I wonder if Melon's home. And I wonder if he's touched my stuff i swear i swear if he's touched my items oh wait what is this oh he at least built me a gravestone with sunflowers and gold but i swear if he's touched my stuff he's gonna die he's gonna pay for it see let me see let me see let me see oh no that looks like he's found it my secret elevator it used to be covered and what is that smell ew it smells like uh, watermelons gross what is he doing he finds my secret base and then he makes it filthy that's it i'm destroying all all these chests the power of the warden i can i can melt them yes they're all gone and now i think i'll replace them with these oh yes yes we'll see who gets the final laugh now taking my secret base and putting watermelons in it absolutely disgraceful and with my warden powers it's time for me to go in 
invisible. Yes. Now I wait. Goats, check out this new doohickey Quandale gave me. I can't wait to store it in my treasure room. I, I don't really know what this is. I think it's like kind of like some kind of sword contraption. But either way, it's awesome. Do 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 do. Life is so peaceful now. All I've got to do is go downstairs and enter Sonny's. I mean, my hidden base. And okay, the chests look a little strange. Why are they like not on the correct block axis and looking at the wall? You know what? It doesn't matter. I'm rich. Who cares? Ah! What is happening? Why are the chests chasing me? Chill! Chill! Die! Die, new doohickey! Ow! <laughs> yes! Yes! That is what you get, melon! All right, guys. I need some gear, and I need to take out these mimics. Give me this iron, and it's time to craft up some armor. That's it. I'm ready to take these mimics down! Die! Die! Why is it TNT? What's going on? What's going on? No, don't tell me. Don't tell me. My hidden base is gone with all my loot! No! Oh, today's been way too depressing. I just want to go to sleep and forget that anything ever happened. Ah, uh, yes. It looks like Melon's finally gone to sleep. And I'm gonna wish him sweet, sweet dreams. Just gonna casually break into the old house. And let's see. <laughs> I'm gonna hide a jukebox right above his head. And it's gonna play some of the most ominous tunes in Minecraft. Music Disc 11. What's that sound? What's going on? What? I don't... Uh, 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 guys, I don't like this! I don't like this! I gotta run. I gotta run. I gotta sleep with Quandales tonight. I can't. I can't deal with this. <laughs> guys, it spooked him so much that he left the house. He's gonna go have a sleepover at Quandales. Look at him run away. Wait a second. That gives me an idea. I'm gonna move this jukebox over to Quandales. Quandale, can I please sleep over? There's scary music and, and sounds coming from my house. It's okay, Melon. You can sleep over for the night. Thank you, Quandale. I'll just head to the basement. I'll sleep nice and cozy with the command blocks. Okay. It looks like Melon is sleeping downstairs in Quandale's house. Time for me to use my warden super strength to break through. Hiya! <sighs> and I'm in. And Quandale is none the wiser. Look at that Melon sleeping with the command blocks. That fool. I'll hide the note block back here. Oh no. Oh no. The sound. The music. Whatever that is. It's back. Oh. 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 I don't like this! I don't like this! Yes! Guys, I scared him again! I'm ruining his sleep! Uh, Quandale! Quandale, do you not hear that? I told you I wasn't going crazy! I don't hear anything, Melon! You're just going insane! Uh, uh, I don't like this! I don't like this! Um, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go see if I can sleep over at, at Steve's uh, in the Target! Guys, I used my warden powers to teleport to Target! I beat Melon here, and I placed some signs for for him. Steve, Steve, can I sleep? Melon, Melon, me can see you. Melon, you will pay, Melon. What is going on? What is going on? Chill, Melon. What are you talking about? Steve, do you not see these creepy signs? Bro, what signs are you talking about? The signs right here. Wait, where are they? Ah! That's it, guys. I can't. I can't tonight. The only way I'll be safe is if I dig a one block hole and cover myself. Tomorrow. I think it's about morning time now. Oh, it is. Finally, I can be at peace. Oh, wait, what time is it? Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm gonna miss my date with Melanie. Melanie, I'm so sorry I'm late. It's okay, Melon. You're always late. Um, I'm really sorry about that. I didn't mean to. It's just I was getting haunted tonight, and I didn't really sleep. I actually dug a hole and stood standing up all night. It sounds like you had a terrible night. I'm so sorry. I hope something like that doesn't happen to you again. Guys, there he is. It looks like Melon's on a date with his girlfriend. Time for me to ruin that. Watch this. I am going to curse him and blind him. And I'll blind Melanie as well. Why not? Just got to splash and sneak up on them. Yes. Oh, Melanie, you're just so beautiful. Guys, that is cringe. Well, at least I won't have to listen to that for much longer. Blind them. Uh, what's going on? Why can't I see anything? 
anything! And guys, watch this. Once Melon's vision returns, the first thing he'll see is this sign. And then I lay the trap. Check it out. The emerald block will be right here. And little will he know, I will be right behind it, ready to summon in his worst nightmare. I can see again. Sorry, Melanie. I don't know what that was. I didn't see either. Also, why is there a sign here? What? Go outside to the emerald block. It's the answer you... Uh, uh, Melanie, I think I should probably do what he says. I don't know. Some ghost's been haunting me, and I don't want to make him any more mad. Who has been doing this? Hello? Hello? Guys, it worked. Melon's at the emerald block. I just need to use my warden powers and go invisible. Excellent. And watch this. Uh, why is there a skull floating? What is that? What is that? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, check it out. Uh, uh, what is happening? What is that thing? Oh, no. Oh, no. What is that? Nightmare? Has this been the thing that's haunting me? Ah! Why? No! <laughs> Guys, it destroyed him! No, Melody! I'll save you! Oh, no. Oh, no. This nightmare thing, it's so close to Melody! What's... It's dying. What could possibly be killing that abomination? <laughs> yes! It's all mine! The scythe of a thousand deaths. What's happening? The structure, it's despawning! <laughs> Sonny, how are you alive? You thought you could just abandon me in the warden skulk? Now I'll turn you into mulch. <laughs> no! Guys, what's wrong with Sonny? He's absolutely insane. And how is he even alive? <sighs> You run, you coward. I'll feast upon Melanie. No, no, no. Sonny, get back here. Get back here. Melanie. Melanie. <laughs> Guys, I've got to find a way to stop him. Maybe Quandale could cure him. Quandale. We've got really, really bad news, bro. What's wrong? Sonny. Sonny didn't die a year ago. Uh, I don't know what happened. There was a warden that could speak, and he was with him, and now he's back. And he's absolutely crazy. Shucks. I should have known this would happen. The warden trained him, and now he's lost his mind. Go to the basement. I have a potion that can make him no longer a psycho. Thank you, Quandell. Okay, Quandell said it should just be right here. Sanity serum potion. With this, I can fix Sonny and save my girlfriend, Melanie. Sonny! Sonny, don't touch her! <laughs> no, no! Don't kill Melanie! I can't die, Sonny. You can't kill me that easily. What is going on? Why can't, why can't she die? What is this? What is wrong with your girlfriend? Sonny, stop this right now! What is happening? Sonny, are you back? Oh, what do you mean am I back? Oh, go outside the emerald block. It's the answer you. Melon, you got emeralds? Sonny, you're not trying to kill me. Why would I try and kill you, bro? You don't remember? The last thing I remember, we were exploring a mine shaft looking for diamonds, and then, wait a second, you abandoned me with a warden! Oh, wait, give me a second. Second and yeah, let me just grab this and Oh, hey, Melon. Hey, Sonny. So what's the last thing you remember? Well, we were at home playing video games, watching Skibbity Toilet, and it was the best day ever! Melanie, why are you here? Wait, why am I here? Don't worry about it, Sonny. All that matters is that the viewers like and subscribe! Okay, goats, I've been thinking a lot about life lately and how I need to be more positive and embrace the gift of giving. So today I want to be really generous and give my best pal Melon something awesome! Awesome. Oh, it's a brand new sports car in melon colors. But first, before I become such a good person, I want to prank the heck out of him. I've got to make Melon's day miserable so that I can surprise him with his dream car. Melon, Melon, I got something to tell you. No, Sonny. I have something to show you. Bro, what are you doing on top of that silo? Get up and in here, Sonny. Oh. 
Okay. What's going on, Melon? What is this place? Sit down, Sonny. I want to show you something. I call this animation the jumping dot. Wow. Isn't it beautiful? Super impressive animation, Melon. That kind of looked more like a wiggling worm. Um, no, Sonny. That's clearly a jumping dot. What are you talking about? It's parkouring off the wall and then it goes down. Yeah, maybe more like a squiggly line. I don't know about a jumping dot, though. No, not a squiggly line. It's a jumping dot. Bro, your animation is trash and you should feel like trash. Better yet, like compost. You know what, Sonny? Get out of here. I didn't want to be in your stupid silo anyways. Yeah, scram, scram. Make like a tree and leaf. Ow, you almost killed me, bro. Relax. It's not that deep. It is that deep, Sonny. Don't ever make fun of my animation. Whatever, Melon. I'm gonna go spend the next two days with Grandma. I'm tired of you. Yeah, yeah, whatever, Sonny. Okay, guys, this is perfect. He thinks I'm gonna go spend the next two days with my Grandma, and he probably expects to have the house all to himself. But really, I'm going over to Quandale's to ask for some advice. Hey, Quandale, got any ideas of how I could troll Melon? Ellen? No, Sonny, of course I don't, but I bet Dondale does so go and check there. <laughs> Good idea, bro. Let me go see what Dondale's up to. Dondale's Tower. Hello? Okay, Dondale, I'm coming up. Uh, it's kind of eerie here. Dondale? Dondale, where are you? Guys, uh, Dondale must have gone on vacation. I don't see him anywhere. But what does this little button do? Whoa! Secret cave! Okay, that was awesome. Maybe Dondale's in here. Uh, what's the passcode? Dang it, Dondale. Why didn't you leave me a note or something? This is so annoying. Uh, what did I just find? There's a secret ghost block entrance. That's so cool. Okay, if Dondale's not here, I'm still gonna have to check out his laboratory and look for some secret experiments I can use to prank Melon. What is this? Ah! Okay, guys, I gotta be quick if I'm gonna make it. Ah! Well, I hope Dondale has good insurance. Ah, Dondale's laboratory. Whoa, what is this stuff? Yo, is this a cake making machine? Yo, bake me a cake. It actually works. Gimme, 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 gimme. Mmm, yummy. Whoa, what's this? Skin change terminal. Sounds pretty fun. Yeah, let's give this a try. Maybe I could change my skin and troll melon. Just gotta press the button. Ah! <laughs> I think it worked. I think it worked. Whoa, I'm a pumpkin. Wait a second. I think I can use this new skin to disguise myself and pretend to be Melon's long lost twin brother, the pumpkin. Oh, I have the whole house to myself. This is awesome. I get to take down Sonny's banner, delete his bed and remove his carpet. Oh yeah, there's too much yellow for this red room. Now, before I go back into town, guys, I've got to choose a new voice so that I have the perfect Perfect disguise. I think this sounds like Melon's long lost twin brother. Yes. Hello there, Mr. Quandale Dingleberry. Look at me when I'm talking to you. I said, look at me. So I heard my twin brother Melon lives here. Twin? I didn't know Melon had a twin brother. I do see the resemblance though. Yes, he lives here nearby. There's a house with a little garden in front of it. That's where he resides. Oh, that's great news, Quandale. And yeah, of course I'm his twin. It's been a long time since he's seen me, though. Takes me way back to when we were wee little stems. And that watermelon was always pooping himself, turning everything into compost and fertilizer. And it was really embarrassing. We used to call him Little Melon Poopington. He'd always poop his pants. And it smelled really bad. Gotta add to the studio a little bit. And now it's done. So we add a little bit of tinkering here. Yeah, yeah, maybe add a little flickering effect. That might look good. Yeah, we'll experiment with that, but that's good for today. <sighs> Time to go talk with Quandale. Maybe he's got some advice to help make my animation even more beautiful. Yo, Quandale! Well, okay, Quandale, I'll see you later. What a beautiful day in Minecraft. Oh, hey there, Melon. 
I am your long lost twin brother, Pumpkin. I don't have a brother. Wait, what do you mean you don't have a brother? Of course you have a brother. Uh, I don't think I have a brother. Yeah, uh, his name is uh, Pumpkin, and then you have another brother named Sonny. Oh, yeah, Sonny. I forgot about him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, anyways, uh, nice to meet you, brother. You have a good day. Guys, I have absolutely no idea who that is. Hang on, his brother. What a weirdo. Anyways, Quandale, what's up? Yo, Quandale. I've got this cool animation I want to show you. Maybe you've got some advice. Hey, Poopy Pants, did you come here to buy new underwear? We ran out of stock. What? And please don't poop yourself inside the store. The janitor is on holiday, and I don't want to clean up your smelly melon poop. Uh, what are you talking about, Quandale? Stop being annoying. Just come to the studio. Okay, Melon Poopington. I know all about your embarrassing history. Don't call me that! My name is Melon! What is... Where is all of this coming from, Quandale? You're being so weird. Your twin brother told me a lot about your stinky incidents from the past. Actually, everyone in the village and beyond knows that you pooped your pants. What are you talking about, everybody? Even this guy? Hey, aren't you Mr. Stinky Poopy Pants who poops in his pants? <laughs> it's not true. I don't even know that guy. You guys gotta believe me. Yeah, whatever, Mr. Poop Man. <gasps> what the heck? I gotta go home. <laughs> All the villagers think I'm weird. Think I pooped everywhere and I'm a poopy pants guy. <laughs> this is the worst day ever. What are you doing here? Oh, hey, brother. Yeah, so I made a few decorative changes to your room. I think you'll appreciate the renovations. Dude, get, this is my house. It's not your place. And what the heck did you do to my room? What the heck? Pumpkins everywhere and you destroyed my bed. I hate pumpkins. What are you doing? What's wrong with you? First, you spread that fake rumor about me and now you mess up my bedroom? I don't know what you're talking about, fake rumors. I just got to town, bro. I haven't even seen anyone yet. Hey, what are you talking about? Quandale told me everything. Oh, yeah, Quandale. He and I had a great chat about your childhood. Anyways, we're family, so you don't mind if I just kick back here for a couple of days while I come through town. No, I I, I actually do. I do. My, all right, whatever. You know what? I can't be bothered right now. I'm just going to go to sleep the next day. <sighs> whatever, bro. Just stay here. Don't talk to anybody. I'm going to go get Quandale, and he's going to look at my epic animation. And he's going to be so happy and impressed, and then he's going to give me tons of diamonds. Wait a second, guys. Did Mel and just say he's gonna show Quandale his animation studio? This looks like a job for Pumpkin. Yes, it's time to sabotage his studio. I've just gotta go inside here and go beneath in the control room. Yo, Quandale, I made this really cool animation. I was trying to tell you about it yesterday. Can you please check it out with me? Okay, sure. Let's go check that out then, Melon. Or should I say Mr. Poopy Pants? Don't call me that! Whatever, Quandale, let's just go. And now I can shut it down. Quandale, it's just up here. Follow me. Hello, Melon. I was just admiring your beautiful animation studio. It's really cool, isn't it, Pumpkin? Yeah, it's awesome, Melon. It's awesome. From now on, don't go in there without me, okay? It's very delicate and anything can mess up that machinery. So please be more careful in here. This is my pride and joy. Anyway, see ya. Ow! Quandale, check out this beautiful animation. I call it the jumping dot. With the press of this button, let's go! Why is nothing happening? Why isn't anything happening? Hold on a second, Quandale. I'll be right back. Uh, trust me, it's gonna be worth your time. You're gonna wanna buy this for millions of diamonds. It's gonna be awesome. Just give me a second, let me fix it. Oh, 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 what is wrong with this thing? What is wrong with it? Oh, oh, what? Where's the turning shaft? Oh, oh, this should fix it. Okay, okay. Quandale, Quandale, it's ready. Quandale, Quandale, where are you? <laughs> That's a great one. That scumbag, Pumpkin. I know he was behind this. That's it. I'm confronting him. Hey, Pumpkin. Hey, Pumpkin. Why did you sabotage my animation? I have no idea what you're talking about. Anyways, Quandale, where were we? Oh, yes, the cake. And remember that time Melon pooped his pet? You know what you did. Don't you dare ignore me. You came out of the animation machine, and then moments later, it's broken. Right before I'm going to show Quandale. And you also spread that rumor about me. What's going on, Pumpkin? Those are dangerous accusations, Big Man Melon. Why don't you just take a chill pill and back off for a second? I'm hanging out with my bro, Quandale. Chill Melon. Pumpkin's a cool dude. Have some accountability once in a while. Why are you hating on him? Just because he's a better friend than you are? Are you kidding me, Quandale? You're taking his side too? That's it. That's it. I can't deal with this. I need to take a nap. I need to take a stress nap. Quandale, I'm sorry about that guy. <laughs> anyway. 
anyways, where were we? Yeah, so the compost. That time Melon was eating compost for breakfast. Yeah, a classic. Oh man, that's hilarious. Ha 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 ha. Anyway, I gotta get back to my shop now. Customer's probably waiting for me. Oh man, what an awesome day. And Melon's actually taking a stress nap right now. So while he sleeps, I might as well get up to no good. Just gotta remove a couple of these. Oh yeah, this is gonna trigger him. Replace all the melons with pumpkins, maybe a couple of carved jack-o'-lanterns, and maybe even some pumpkin bombs. He's gonna have to be really careful not to mess with these. Ooh, it's getting a little late. I gotta kiss my melons goodnight. Uh, uh, melons, melons, come over here. Wait, my melons? Where are my melons? Why are they all pumpkins? Let's come back. I know he's- <gasps> Look, there's even some melon pieces. No, no. That's it. That's it. I've had it with this guy. I'm gonna break them all. Melon, you've got to relax. What would the villagers think of this massacre? You deserve it. You started this war. You start- What is wrong with you? What have you done? What is that? Let there be pumpkins. And Halloween candy. Yum. <laughs> That's it. This scumbag thinks he can destroy all my melons. That's it. I'm breaking all of his pumpkins. Oh, these candies will be the perfect gift for my date, Melanie. What did you say? You're trying to steal my girl now, too? That's the last straw, pumpkin. It's over for you. You're dead. Melon, Melon, relax. Relax. Quandale, Quandale. Get over here. You're a dead pumpkin. You're a dead fruit. You're a dead pumpkin. Produce. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. Stop it, Melon, before I do something to you. You know why? Because he spread fake rumors about me. He broke my animation machine. He blew up my melons, blew up my house, changed my room, and now he's trying to steal my girl, Melanie. Okay, that's it, Melon. You crossed the line. The whole village has had enough of your shenanigans. Pumpkin is our friend and a cool guy. And the only thing you've been doing since he arrived is accusing him of bad things and trying to harm his reputation. Well, no more. You're about to face serious consequences, Melon. Yeah, I'm a good guy. No, he's not. Oh, it's over for you, Melon. We will get rid of you tomorrow morning. You deserve it. Wait, no, no! Oh, where am I? Today, brothers and sisters, we're going to have delicious roasted watermelon. Like, no, guys, don't do this. Pumpkin, you scumbag, pumpkin. Hey, villagers, please, you don't have to do this. Uh, it was actually just an innocent prank. I'm actually Sunny. I'm not pumpkin. Please, please don't kill my brother, Melon. We don't believe you. You obviously lost your mind or you're trying to lie to us. Besides, why would Sunny tell everyone that his brother poops his pants. Hmm? Yeah, why would Sonny do that? It's obvious, guys. It's freaking hilarious. I'm sorry, though. I didn't mean for it to go this far. You're lying. Pumpkin's a legend and a hero. You're just trying to lie to us so you can save this watermelon. Well, we won't let you stop us. No, no. I'll prove it. I'll prove it. Just give me one hour. Melon, I'll be back. I gotta change back into my Sunny skin. Uh, hurry up, bro. Guys, I made it to Dondale's Tower, but I have to hurry. I've got 45 minutes left to save Melon. Come on. Come on. Hurry. I gotta get to the skin machine. I'll have to build using my pumpkins. For melon. For melon! Yes, the laboratory entrance. Okay, now if I just program my skin, stand inside of the terminal, and press the button, I should transform back into Sunny! <laughs> I think it worked. My hand is yellow, and I'm back to normal. Now I just gotta take some water and get back to Melon quickly. Come on, come on. I've gotta hurry. I've gotta hurry. I'm running out of time. I only have five minutes to get back to the village. Melon, please be alive. I'm so dehydrated. Oh, all this smoke, all the moisture's left my body. Melon, I'm here. Don't worry. See, villagers, it was me. I wasn't lying to you. It's too late. Time for roasted watermelon. Ah, what the heck? The villagers, why are they so angry? That's it. It's time for plan B. Melon, I'll out the fires. Help me, Sonny. I'm trying. I'm trying. These villagers are crazy. And get out of there, Melon. We gotta go. We gotta go. Melon, follow me. I, uh, 
I have something to show you. I, I actually prepared a gift for you to make up for all these pranks. Dude, it better be like an awesome melon car or something, or else it's over for you. Whoa, how'd you know? Wait, it actually is? <gasps> really, Sonny? I forgive you for everything that you've done. Sonny, this is just a cliff. No, melon. This is the price of forgiveness. Uh, whoa. <gasps> it's so beautiful. Sonny, hop in. Ow! Melon, what are you doing in the wall? Sorry about that, Sonny. Let me just open these doors and... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What do you think you're doing? That's my car. What are you talking about? This is my car. No, no, this is your car. This is my car? Are you kidding me? Today in Minecraft, we went to visit our friend in the hospital. Uh, Sonny, this hospital's kind of suspicious. Uh, Melon? Dr. Longbottom's turned all the patients into mutants! Goats, we're surrounded! If all of you press the like button at the same time, you can help us defeat the mutants. Ooh, that was close. We're saved. Thanks to you, goats. Alex, what is it? Is everything okay? No, Sonny, it's not okay. I'm so worried about Steve. He got sick and went to the hospital. But he's been there for over two weeks and no one knows when he's coming back. Can you please check on him? Yeah, don't worry, Alex. We got you. Melon, do you know where the hospital is? Um, Alex, do you know where the hospital is? It's just down the road. Please get there fast and tell me where Steve is. I'm so worried. Okay, don't you worry. We'll bring him some of your freshly baked bread. Let's go, Sonny. There's no time. I'm right behind you, bro. Let's get to this hospital and find Steve. Sonny, we've made it to the Hopidal. Wait, are you sure this is the right place? This is not called the hospital. I'm pretty sure it's just a typo, Sonny. Steve! Steve, where are you? Or maybe people come here when they're all out of hope. They get a refill at the Hopidal. <laughs> ah, I see what you did there. Sonny, but this hospital doesn't look like it's filled with a lot of hope. There's no one here. It kind of feels abandoned. Yeah, this is a bit strange. Maybe they all went on vacation? Who knows, Sonny? We've just got a find Steve and deliver him some of this freshly baked bread. Hello? Anybody here? Sonny, what is happening? What was that, bro? It was like an earthquake. Uh, I don't know. We should probably get out of here, bro. The worst place you can be is in... Melon, there's no way out. There's bedrock. What the heck? Okay, okay. Through the windows, maybe? Sonny, what? Oh, no. This hospital. It was a trap, bro. We've got to find a way out. Looks like there's an elevator. But wait, there's bedrock. Barriers! We can't get in! Sonny, Sonny, do you see this, though? Check it out. There's redstone lamps. Maybe if we activate them, it'll disable the barriers! You're right, bro! Let's try and figure out how to turn on each of these redstone lamp generators. I'll check out this area of the hospital. Um, I'll also check it out, because I'm very scared. Oh, whatever. Fine, we'll stick together. Ooh, what's in this room? Absolutely nothing! That's what! Bro, there's crafting tables. Come on, there's gotta be a clue around here somewhere. Ooh, maybe this button by the pooper or this lever. Wait, Sonny, there's levers in there? Yeah, did something happen? Go check the redstone lamps. Uh, it's very strange that there's... Oh, wait, that's the bathroom, Sonny. Yeah, I know, but there was a lever. There's a lever here, too. I thought you were saying these were levers. Bro, these are trip wires that are set up to be coat hangers for your jacket. You're right, Sonny, but for some reason, they're not in this room, but they're almost identical rooms. Why are they missing? I don't know, dude. Let's just keep looking. There's a lot more hospital rooms. Come on, there's gotta be something. Yo, this room's got levers. Wait, wait, wait. This is different, Sonny. This is different. Did you hear that? Yeah, it sounded like a door open. Wait, Sonny, Sonny, flick them back down. I'll look for that. I feel like I'm hearing the sound. Okay, listen closely. I think it's in this iron door room. No. Wait, it is, Sonny. It is. Okay, I'll flick them again. Yes, bro, you opened some kind of secret passage. Hold up. Melon, let me see this. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Hello? Oh, in here. Yo, Sonny, how are we gonna get down there, though? Carefully. Geronimo! Yeah, Melon, don't do that. Sonny! No! Sonny! Hey, Melon, I'm back! Turns out my respawn point got set to the hospital, so even death won't help us escape. What the heck? We're trapped here forever! No, 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 Melon, not forever. There's clearly an exit down here. We just have to figure out a way to break our fall. Maybe if we could find some water somewhere. Or a hay bale. Dude. 
dude. There's gotta be something. Well, there's barrels in here, Sonny. Uh, there's an analog lever. That could be useful for later. Perhaps, but we don't even know what that means. And Sonny, in this barrel, there's a water bucket. Okay, that's perfect. Now, Melon, I need you to do a clutch jump. Okay, well, Sonny, before we do that, check this out, bro. There's literally quartz lab, polished diorite, and teleport.exe. Melon, we don't want to mess with things we don't understand. Just leave it where you found it. Fine, I'll leave the lever and the teleport.exes. Sonny, it's time for me to clutch. Are you ready? Let's go, oh, chill! Okay, okay, clutch! That was just sad. Melon, give me the bucket. I'll show you how it's done. Fine. I can do this! Let's go! I placed it and still splattered. Well, Sonny, you did it. You made a safe passage for me. Let's go! My turn! Yes, we've arrived. Sonny, it looks like there's two parkour options. You want to take the left and I take the right? Sounds like a plan, except I can't go to the left. Bro, are you kidding me? There's more invisible barriers? Yeah, bro, we're stuck here. There's only one path. We've got to get all the way around this. I got this, Sonny. Oh, you got this. All right. Just a little further. One head bumper. Yes, I'm through. You did it, Sonny. Now it's my turn to shine. No! No! Here, Melon, grab this. Too slow. Well, Sonny, that would have been nice a little bit earlier. It's fine, bro. Now I could go all the way around this way and then flick that lever and it should open up this iron door. Here we go. Oh, oh, big jumps. Let's go. You did it, Sonny. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. I'm the real goat. I know. Uh, Sonny, this next level looks like a two-player parkour. No way. All right, you activate those pressure plates. I'll make these jumps. I believe in you, Sonny. Do it. Huh, huh. Yes, yes, first try. Hey, Sonny, you missed the lever that was right there. Oh, no. All right, all right. Hold that pressure plate. Hold that thought. Hold on, I'll get both at the same time, Sonny. Thank you. And now I'll grab that lever. Perfect. Sonny, you're just gonna have to let me... Just stand on both, bro. Yeah, there you go. Sonny! All right, go for it. Ah! Sonny! Why? I didn't do anything. You're just trash. You know what you did, Sonny. What? What did I do? I don't know, but you did something. Give me this lever. And let's go! Excellent. Now, one of us should open this door, and one of us should hold on to their lever. Eh, uh, nope. We're gonna have to use it right here, Sonny. Yeah, that makes sense, actually. Whoa, what is this? Wait, Melon! It looks like the first switch to disable one of the barriers that's blocking out the elevator. You're right, Sonny! Enable the disable It worked! I think, because there was a really cool particle effect. Well, we're gonna have to check it out. Sonny! Yo, it worked! One of the lights is enabled! That's awesome! Now we just need to figure out how to enable the next two redstone lamps. Okay, Sonny. I say we split up to cover more ground. I thought you were scared like a chicken. <laughs> nope. Bye. I'm not a chicken, bro. I've grown some melons, and now I'm ready to explore on my own. All right, you have fun with that, bro, and I'll explore on my own, too, and I'll find the next generator. Yeah, we'll see about that. I'm telling you, there's gonna be, like, a secret ghost block or secret door or secret painting. Check everywhere, Melon. Ah! Melon, I found something. Whoa! I just got teleported when I pressed that button. Uh... Melon! Melon, can you hear me? What is this place? And Melon can't even hear me. Oh no, Melon can't hear me, guys. Uh, hello? What is this place? And why does this patient look so messed up? This isn't Steve. This guy looks so sick, though. Hello, sir, sir, I'm here to help. Wake up, I'll get you out of this hospital. Sir, is everything okay? Ah! Ah! This is cursed! This is cursed! He's after me! Oh, no. Oh, no. I've got to get out of this place and find Melon! No! 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 Where is he? There he is! Levers! Levers! Ah! Oh, no. I gotta make the jumps! Ah! He's still after me! What is wrong with this hospital? This patient's psychotic! Oh, no. Oh, no. I gotta get out of here. I've got to get out of here! Boat clutch! Maybe I lost him. No! He's still here! I gotta get out of here. I've got to get out of here. I have to warn Melon about this. Yo, he's still behind me. Slime jump. Let's go. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's right behind me. Oh, boy. Laser beams. <laughs> he's still right behind me. Ah, please 
do something. Yes, I got him trapped. What does this do? No way. No way. He's suffocating in the gravel. Let's go. And this lever, it should enable one of the redstone lamps to deactivate the barrier. Yes, it actually worked. We've got two of the redstone lamps enabled and it teleported me back to the main hospital floor. So that was convenient. Melon? Hey, Melon, are you here? Bro, I just escaped a crazy guy and enabled one of the redstone generators. Hello? Meanwhile, there's something off about this room. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the bed or something. Ah, what the heck? Oh, guys, what is this? Why is there skulls everywhere? And what the heck is that? Why is there a nurse here? Or a patient? And why is he so bloody? Don't worry, I'll save you. Get up. Wait, why can't I hit him? Uh, hello, sir? Uh, guys, I don't like this. I don't like this. I gotta go. Uh, is he? Yo, he's chasing me. Gotta do this parkour. I gotta do this parkour. Is he behind me? Oh, no. Oh, no. Drop her. Drop her. Oh, surely you can't do that. No. What is this? What is this? Ah, oh, gotta go. I gotta go. He's not. Oh, no. He's smart enough, guys. This is not good. Oh, no. He's still chasing me. Why? Who is this patient? What does he want from me? What is happening? Why is he breaking the cactuses oh no oh no he's gonna hit me with the cactus go oh, oh guys is he coming wait a second Whew, i think we lost him oh no oh, oh, oh he's still chasing me what the heck oh no oh no it's a dead end please please what the heck what do these levers do what do these levers do oh no wait, yo i trapped him what does this one do it's lowering lava burn burn you villain let him cook and guys with the flick of this lever i'll enable one of the redstone lamps let's go melon melon where are you sonny i'm here bro i'm right behind you bro where did you go um so i was looking at this bed then i fell into a ghost block then i got chased by this evil doctor thing it was kind of creepy wait that happened to you too i got chased by an evil patient hey what the heck that happened to you as well yeah dude that guy was trying to kill me i had to do this insane parkour dude i had the exact same story well that's weird and i was even able to get one of these redstone lamps turned on melon did you get the last one i guess i did does that mean the barriers are gone yes the elevator it works it's time to go up and by that i meant down and by that I meant up. Whoa, Sonny, we've made it to the second floor. What's up there? It's time for us to relax. And we should probably find Steve. You're right, Sonny. Maybe he's here somewhere. Steve, Steve. Hello. Melon, check every room. There's gotta be a room with some patience in it. Hello. Steve, Steve. Have you found anything yet? I didn't, Sonny. I, I, maybe I missed something. Wait a second. What about this hallway? Hello? <gasps> Melon, I found a patient. Sir, is everything okay in here? Dang it, it's not Steve. Is somebody there? Ah, oh, I am in such pain. I can barely speak or see. Yeah, 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 that's great. I'm glad you're in pain and suffering and all that. But what the heck is this place? And who are you? Just get me a healing potion and I'll tell you everything. Uh, Sonny, do you see any healing potions around here? I only see this locked chest. Um, well, let's go look for something. There's gotta be a healing potion around here somewhere. It's a hospital. Sonny, this is insane. Insane. I can't find any kind of barrel or chest anywhere. Sonny, I found a barrel. Yo, it's got a lingering potion of regen. That's perfect. It should cure the patient of all of his pain. And then he can tell us what the heck's happening. Here you go, sir. Oh. I feel much better now. Thank you so much. Listen, I only know that some evil doctor brought me here, and I have been stuck here ever since. You need four special levers to go up. I have one lever along with armor and tools. Password is 1712. The rest are inside this hospital. Hurry and save us. Okay, sir. Thank you for that information. And you even have some items for us. Let's see. Yo, Melon, check this out. Fiery armor set, stakes, and our first analog lever. Melon, didn't you find an analog lever earlier? Yeah, I did, and I found some teleport.exe blocks, but remember we said we don't want to mess with them because we might uh, mess up the quantum mechanics of the universe and the time rift, and we might destroy Minecraft as we know it. No, no, no. I didn't say anything about a time rift or the quantum universe. All I said is we don't know what they do, so don't touch them. But now, we know we need four analog levers! Okay, well I know where one is. You have one, which means there's only two left to find. Let's do this. Yo, Melon! I found another analog lever! We just need 
need the last one. And I'm about to grab the one we had earlier. Bada bing, bada boom. Give me that analog lever. Oh, come on. There's gotta be one around here somewhere. In this little cauldron? No. Sonny, are you sure we need these levers? I'm pretty sure I can just go up. It's not working, dang it! Of course it's not gonna work, bro. We have to turn on each of these redstone lamps. Well, at least crank them on right now, Sonny. Just one more. Okay, search and scour every single room. Yeah, bro, I was in the middle of searching until you interrupted me. <sighs> Melon, a chest, please. Yes, the last lever. Yes! Now we can go and save Steve. Going up. Let's do it. Steve, Steve, where are you? Steve? Was that you? Steve! Oh no, that's just a hamburger. Does look tasty though. I swear I heard Steve. He's around here somewhere. Steve! No way. We actually found him. Steve, we're so sorry. And Alex is really worried about you. Sonny, Melon, is that you? I knew you'd come. You need to save us. Dr. Longbottom's kidnapped all of the patients and turned them into mutants. You gotta stop him. That's who's behind all this evil? Melon, it makes perfect sense. We should have known. You need to find the teleport.exe <laughs> block and use it to go to the secret room where Dr. Longbottoms is hiding. Please save everyone. Melon, please tell me you have the teleport.exe blocks. No, Sonny, I didn't mess with those because I didn't want to destroy the quantum mechanics of the universe. Okay, that's fine. At least tell me they're still in that barrel downstairs. Yep, they are, Sonny. Let's go grab them. I'm right behind you. And Steve, we'll come back for you once we defeat Dr. Longbottoms. Sonny, they should just be inside this barrel. Perfect. Give me one of those teleporters. I got you, bro. And now melon all that's left to do is teleport let's go whoa it's working it's working dr longbottoms you're not gonna get away with this of course i am you fools can't stop me i own this hospital now with my ultra powerful mutant patients you won't believe how strong they really are prepare to die dang it he always seems to get away what do you think he was talking about though prepare to die i don't know maybe he has dice somewhere multiple dice oh Oh, like we're gonna roll dice and play a board game like Monopoly? Probably. Uh, Sonny, I think I know what he meant by prepare to die. Yep, it's not Monopoly. Mutant Wardens. Bro, how? Let's take him out. Take him out. Gross, gross. They're so gross. Ow. Sonny, Sonny, they're too strong, bro. We gotta get out of here. No, no, we can take them. We can take them. Are you sure, Sonny? I don't know. Well, I'm not, I'm not exactly positive, but I'm hoping we can. I gotta eat this steak, bro. They're not doing a lot of damage to me. They're mostly concentrated on you. Yeah, bro, they're obliterating me. My health is tanking. Sonny, Sonny. Ow, ow. Bro, this is not cool. Why do they want me dead so badly? You'd be a way better mutant melon. They're so close to death. I can feel it. What kind of mutant wardens are these? Just keep slicing, slice. Ow, ow. You know what, melon? You're on your own. I'm out of here. Bro, run. Hey, they can't get us up here. Ow! Nope, Melon, we gotta kill them. They're too strong. They can kill us even while we're up there. Bro, they can get us anywhere. One's dead, Sonny! Yo! We did it! We defeated the ultimate mutant mob. Now, Melon, what was Dr. Longbottom stashing up here? He has a piece of bedrock, Sonny. How did he even do that? No, Melon, I'm pretty sure this is the bedrock that's protecting the hospital and locking us all in. Oh, you're right. With the flick of this lever, We'll disable it. Did you feel that? It was like another earthquake. Yeah, bro. It must have worked. And now what's in this chest? Oh, it's health potions. We can save Steve and all the other patients with these. Let's go. And Melon, do you mind scooching a little bit? I'm pretty sure there's a teleport button behind you. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Steve, Steve, we've got the regen potion. Yo, Steve, please get better. I feel amazing. Thank you guys so much. Uh, Steve, looks like you lost a bit of weight while you're in the hospital. It looks like they stretched you out, Steve. Yeah, Dr. Longbottoms put me through the big stretchy machine, but I kind of like my new height now. Well, as long as you're happy, Steve. Now let's get out of here. Let's go. We did it, Melon. We saved all the patients from the hospital. Yes, we're heroes, Sonny, and we ruined Dr. Longbottom's plans. Let's go. And if you want to be a hero too, just press the like and subscribe buttons. Today in Minecraft, something really weird happened to Sonny. 
Hello, Melon. I think I will eat this plain bread with nothing on it for breakfast. What the heck? He's so boring and emotionless today. I tried everything to cheer him up. Even a roller coaster couldn't make him excited. We have to save Sunny Goats. Make sure you're subscribed and stick around until the end because we had to fight some insane monsters to get the antidote. <sighs> Guys, tonight's the night. While Melon is sound asleep, I'm gonna go on an adventure. <laughs> You are so gross! I don't know what he's doing in his sleep, but it sounds disgusting! <laughs> Bro, he's talking in his sleep and he's snoring so weirdly. Whatever, I need to focus up. My plan tonight was to go on an adventure without Melon. I'm gonna bring my diamond armor with me. My precious, precious diamonds. And do we have any more diamonds? Uh... Ah, there it is. My diamond pickaxe. Cause tonight I'm going spelunking! Which means cave exploring. And I just need to go to our local mine shaft and descend into the depths. Oh, this is gonna be so awesome. I'm gonna find the greatest treasures ever. Hey, good evening, Bob. Looks like you're hard at work as usual. Oh, hello, Sonny. What are you doing up so late? Uh, you know me. Rise and grind. Sonny, it's two in the morning. You should be asleep. Yeah, I'm on that new rock schedule. Start my day at 2 a.m. and I finish it at midnight. Two hours of sleep is plenty. Ah, uh, yep. Time to grind. <laughs> Oh, Melanie, oh, I love her so much. I haven't found any diamonds yet, guys. Oh, what is this place? This is both scary but exciting at the same time. It's beckoning me, calling me in. Oh, what is this? The treasure room of legends. But what the heck? There's no treasure in here. There's no diamonds anywhere. I don't even see any emeralds. And where's the chest? There should have been a chest here. What the heck, guys? There's no loot. Oh, come on. Come on, how is there no treasure? <gasps> Secret chest! Wait, these don't look like normal diamonds. Dark diamonds. Oh, I've gotta have them. This is actually very ordinary. Pretty boring, if I'm being honest. Well, I guess that's all for tonight. Time for me to head home and get some sleep. It's really not healthy to only sleep two hours per night. Oh no, I got home and the sun's already up. Unfortunately, I won't be able to get any more rest tonight. Good morning, Melon. I hope you slept well. Yo, what's up, Sonny? Wait, why do you have full diamond armor? I took it from our basement, and I went on an adventure last night so that I could find some really cool treasure. Okay, did you get cool treasure? Also, why are you talking so weirdly? I don't think I'm talking weirdly at all. I'm talking very normally. But to answer your question, yes, I did find some really cool treasure. Take a look. You can hold one for yourself. Here are the other four. These are called dark diamonds, some of the rarest in Minecraft. Bro, give me all of them right now! Melon, you need to calm down. These dark diamonds are really rare. Guys, he's not even even responding to the fact that I punched him. Usually he hits me back or something. Uh, Sonny, are, are you okay, bro? I'm fine. Last night when I went treasure hunting, I found this really suspicious dungeon that contained these dark diamond blocks. I had a hunch that maybe they were like dark matter and they could have some adverse effects, but they were so rare and legendary, I could not pass them up. So I brought them home. Okay, well, do you want to do something fun then? No, not really. What? You always want to do something fun. That's it, guys. I'm going to make him do something fun. On second thought, Melon, I am having a lot of fun. Watching this cozy campfire is exhilarating. Sonny, that is like the lamest thing ever. This is too sad, guys. I'm gonna take him and we're gonna do bouncy balls. Sonny always loves playing with bouncy balls. Yo, Sonny, come outside. I gotta show you something very important. Okay, Melon, I'm right behind you. I'm gonna need you to take this and then... Check it out! Bouncy balls! Melon, I don't think this is a very good idea. Idea. It's totally immature and for kids. No, this isn't for kids, Sonny. This is like your favorite thing. No, Melon. I'm pretty sure I'm not a fan of big bouncing balls. You always love big bouncing balls all over the place. You love bouncing on them, and you love it when I throw them in your face. You love big bouncing balls. Well, Melon, not anymore. I'm not quite as childish as the old days. Okay. Well, I have something else you'll like if you don't like big bouncing balls all over your face. Can you please stop saying big bouncing balls all over your face? That's very immature and could be potentially construed as quite sus. Well, you know what's not sus? An air balloon ride! 
Wow, that does sound intriguing. Melon, Melon, where did you go? Where are the hot air balloons? Oh, there you are, Melon. Yeah, Sonny, I've got two air balloons prepped, so I'm just gonna go into yours. Yes, and then I'll ride yours. No, 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 Sonny. Red is also a very nice color. What? You think red's a nice color? That's actually how you feel? Well, it's not about feelings. Colors are all the same. They're all quite nice. This is so weird, guys. Sonny is kind of being nice in this weird emotionless state that he's in. Sonny, do you have some coal to fly that thing? Yes, this hot air balloon is nicely powered up. I have an excellent view up here. So you like it? Would you say you're having fun? No, I wouldn't call this fun. The heck, guys? I can't do anything to make this dude have fun. There's one thing I know for sure will work. Sonny, we're heading to the theme park. Okay, Melon, what's the the theme of this park. Oh man, this is sad. The park is sad? That sounds interesting. We should totally go there. Look at this place, Sonny. Isn't it so incredibly awesome? It seems okay, I guess. Guy doesn't enjoy anything? Okay, well, we'll see how you feel once you're on the ride. Here's the ride, Sonny. Isn't she beautiful? She's okay, but the wait time is 69 hours. That sounds like a lot of fun. Dude, get on the ride. We don't have any wait time, Sonny, because I bought out the whole park. Melon, you're jumping over the lines. You have to follow the path according to its layout. Not if you have a bouncing ball. Just take the bouncing ball and bounce, please. I can't. I can't. <sighs> And I made it. All right, Sonny, I'll let you take the first ride. Now, before I jump in this minecart, Melon, is this supposed to be fun? Yes, you're gonna have a lot of fun, Sonny. Because I'm not sure you realize this entire theme park is designed by the corporation Mega Giants, whose only goal is to squeeze every dollar out of you. Dude, just, just go in the minecart and I'll press the button, please. I can't deal with you talking. And go! We. Whoa. This is is really fun. Isn't that what the kids would say? I guess so, because they don't realize all of their money is being taken by the soulless corporate mega giants. Into the dragon's mouth! Sonny, wasn't that so much fun? No. What do you mean that wasn't fun? Okay, you know what? I know what I can do that will make you have fun. Do you want to prank me? Not really. That seems pretty immature. You love pranking me, Sonny. Uh, well, do you want to play hide and seek then? Not really, Melon. I I kind of like to go home now and look at the campfire. Guys, there's definitely something wrong with Sonny. All of his favorite things he used to love doing, he doesn't even care for anymore. And he sounds so soulless. Sonny, we gotta talk to Quandale. Why would I want to talk to Quandale? Okay. Quandale, there's something really wrong with Sonny. What's wrong with him, Melon? Just talk to him and you'll know what I mean. Greetings, Quandale. My friend Watermelon Man wanted me to have a conversation with you. I'm not really sure about what. Uh, hey, Sonny. You sound pretty odd. Feeling under the weather or something? Yes, the weather today is very okay. How astute of you to notice, Mr. Dingle. Anything else, Melon? Or can I leave now? Quandale, what is wrong with him? Uh, I can't say nothing yet, but head to the scanner and I'll tell you if the computer can confirm my suspicions. Uh, Sonny, you can't leave yet. You're gonna have to follow me into his back room. Interesting. I'm curious what he keeps in his secret back room's facility. Now, Sonny, I'm gonna need you to walk into that yellow scanner room right there. Whoa. Curious. This is quite the spectacle. It says the scan has been completed. Perfect! Now, Quandale should be able to give you a diagnosis. A diagnosis? But I'm perfectly healthy. No, Sonny, there's definitely something wrong with you. Just as I thought. His emotions have been completely wiped out. I know a place where you two can go to get them back, though it won't be easy. I will give you the coordinates now. Thank you so much, Quandale. We need to cure you, Sonny. Follow me! It's not gonna be easy, but we can make it work. Okay. Later. Oh. What the heck is this place? Big Man Melon, it looks like another one of those elevator blocks. Oh, thank you, Sonny. That's actually very useful. Oh, it looks like this is some kind of obby. Follow me, Sonny. You just gotta make the jumps accurately, and it's actually not that hard when you do it. Great work, Melon Man. This is pretty easy. Uh, Sonny, you're very good at ladder jumps. I think you should do this parkour first. Yes. All of these jumps were quite simple. Shall I continue without you? You should continue without me, Sonny. Wait, hold on, man. 
maybe I can use one of my big red bouncing balls and... Hiya! Hiya! Melon, if you just want to climb up this wall, you just had to ask. Wait, what? You can use a pickaxe in here? But of course, can't you? No. What the heck, Sonny? I can't break any blocks in here. Interesting. Is this supposed to be challenging? It feels quite easy. Sonny, this is very difficult. I don't know what you're talking about. Dang it! Shall I wait? Yes, wait for me, Sonny. Wait for me. And jump there. Jump there. I'm gonna do it. Don't worry, Sonny. I'll save you! And I've made it. Um, hmm. Appears we've reached a dead end. Very observant, Melon. However, contrary to your observations, I believe these are elevator blocks. Wait, what? You actually might be right. Whoa! Where are we? Whoa. That was crazy. I don't know what this place is. These levers, they must have something to do with these dark blocks. Hiya! Wait a second. They all turned back to normal. The diamond blocks. They're no longer dark diamond blocks. What does that mean? <laughs> I'm so sad. I just want to get some sleep. Please. I'm so tired. What? Sonny's crying? What the heck? Sonny, did you gain back the emotion of sadness? <laughs> Bro, just let me sleep. Yes! It's actually making progress. I mean, I'm sorry, Sonny, that you're super sad, but this is progress. We're one step closer to restoring all your emotions back. Well, can we please just finish restoring them all? I want happiness. All right, Sonny, just follow me. We got to go down. <laughs> Get me out of here, please. This is the yellow room. I wonder what emotion yellow represents. I'm so tired. <laughs> I just want to go home. <laughs> Dude, this version of Sonny is so annoying. I kind of preferred when he had no emotions. <laughs> Dude, stop moping about, Sonny. We gotta do this if you want to be happy again. I'm trying my best. <sighs> Let me home. Let me home. Sonny, how are you doing this so effectively? It appears there's barrier blocks. And then... Hoo We've made it. And these are elevators. <laughs> now, when I flick this lever, it should turn this dark gold into normal gold and revealing... I don't know what kind of emotion this is. We're gonna find out. Hey Sonny, how you feeling, buddy? I feel amazing! Two hours of sleep and I'm a goat! I'm so good at this game, bruh! I'm the best! I'm awesome! Oh, hey, Melon. Guys, I think the gold represents energy! He's so energetic right now! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Oh, I feel so happy. I feel so alive. I haven't felt like this in decades, in centuries, in millennia. Woo! Let's go! Okay, this is a step in the right direction, but he's a little too crazy. We gotta calm him down. Goat mode! Goat mode! Goat mode! Woo! Woo! Yo, chill, chill. You're going real fast right now, Sonny. Chill. You can't slow me down. You can't slow me down. I won't be stopped! Let's go! Woo! I feel so good right now. Jump, jump, jump. How are you doing this, Sonny? How? See ya, Melon. I got better places to be. Woo! Big jump, baby. And final jump, yeah. This looks crazy. Oh, nails it. Crushes it. Absolutely goaded. The barriers and the door combo. They thought they could slow me down. They were mistaken. Sonny, Sonny, chill. How do you do this door jump? There's a barrier on the bottom of it, you fool. Oh, I knew that. I knew that. And... Who? Come on, Melon. You can do it. I believe in you. Let's go. Let's go. Hiya. And... Hiya. Congratulations, Melon. We're moving on. Y'all relax. You almost killed me. Sorry. I'm just so hyped up right now. You gotta learn to take a chill pill sometimes, Sonny. Not possible. Not when you're on this type of a hot streak. Let's freaking go. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Next elevator, Melon. The next elevator. I wonder where it goes. Whoa. These blocks, they're calling for me. Yes, I need them. These blocks, be part of me. I hear Sonny. I gotta hurry up. Whew. Final jump, made it. And Sonny, chill, 
Chill, bro. Yes! These blocks! One of us. One of us. Honestly, guys, I don't know if I should flick this lever. Well, hopefully everything goes right. Booyakasha! Uh, Sonny, bro, how you feeling? Jealous. Envious. Angry! Uh, yo, chill! Chill! Chill, you're gonna kill me! I gotta get out of here. Chill, Sonny! Relax! Guys, he only has three emotions. He's not stable yet. <gasps> I'm gonna kill these things! Show yourselves! Calm down, Sonny, calm down! Sonny, this is a task you must face alone. Yeah, cuz I'm gonna kill you! Ow! No! Relax! Calm down! <laughs> Give me this loot! Give me this treasure! Barriers in the way. Why? Why are there barriers stopping me? Sonny, this is the ghost of Melon. You must defeat them. Their hearts are cold. Like mine? My heart feels cold right now. Uh, ghost of Melon? What's the deal? Kill them! I'm gonna kill them all! Die! Die! But be careful, Sonny. Beware! Beware what? Beware what? Of myself? Because I'm all powerful. These things, they probably turned me into this. I'm a monster. I'm an absolute demon. Die. Yes. Now give me the treasure. Beware of the Alpha Yeti. Why is he guarding the chest? Put me down. Put me down, big bro. You don't want this heat. Ow, 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 ow. This is crazy. This is actually crazy. I'm totally jealous of him. Look at his big muscles. He's so thick. This is the ghost of Melon. Take this and slay the Alpha Yeti. Oh, this is gonna give me ultimate power. Let's go. You think you're so cool? I'm gonna harvest your soul and eat it for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Just get over here, yo. Get over here, you big goofy yeti. You're all mine. Oh, yeah, you're stuck in that wall now. It doesn't feel so good, huh? And now you're finished. You're finished! Yes, bow down to your king. That's me. And die. What did he drop? Wait a second. He stole the treasure from earlier. This must be it. Emotion bottle. Ghost of Melon's past. Should I use this? Or should I stay? Go! Sonny, you must use it quickly or you're gonna die and become like me, a ghost. What happened? Where am I? Oh, Melon, what happened to you? Oh, I just took an invisibility potion and pretended I was a ghost. And why would you do that? Because you lost all your emotions, killed me, and then I had to manipulate you emotionally so you would kill this Alpha Yeti and drink this potion and get your emotions back. Seems fair enough to me. High five! No! Chill! And if you all want a high five, just press the like and subscribe button. Let's go. Today in Minecraft, Sunny won't stop annoying me. Hey, Melon, I replaced all the watermelons in your garden with poo. Ugh, oh, Sunny. That's it, goats. I'm gonna leave the server. Wait, no, no, no. Melon, please don't. Goats, please put crying emojis in the comments if you don't want Melon to leave forever. Ah, beautiful day to listen to some music. Let's see here. Melohi. Ew. Why is that on the sunny side? Get that out of there. Or chirp. Yeah. Let's listen to some chirp. Beautiful. So relaxing. I could just sit back and enjoy today all by myself. Although, I do kind of wonder what Melon's been up to. I haven't seen him in a few hours. And I think one more Melon right here. Maybe Melon here. Melon there. Melon here. And the final melon. My new house is beautiful. Ah, oh, it's so nice to get away from Sunny. It's a little tiny, but it does the trick. I guess it's time to show it off to Sunny a little bit. Sunny! Hey, Sunny! Wait, why am I hearing Melon's voice? He sounds so far away. Uh, Melon! Melon, where are you? Get out here right now, Sunny! I want to show you my new house! Yeah, I see you on top of the mountain! Yo, come up here, Sunny. I want to show you something. You're pretty far up there. Just give me a minute. Hurry up, Sonny. Hurry up. I want to show off my new cottage retreat, aka my new house. Wait, what? This is where you've been all day? You've been building a new melon house? Yeah, isn't it awesome, bro? Look, I got the melon path that goes inside, and it's just big enough for one person. Bro, what's your problem? I thought you liked our house. We used to hang out every day, listen to music, play video games. Wait, Wait a second, you even have your own cake? Yeah, Sonny. I had to move out because somebody. Hey, 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 what are you doing? No, it's my cake. Because somebody eats all the cake every single day. I couldn't stand it anymore, Sonny. Hey, it's not 
my fault my stomach is so thick. Sonny, you're just fat. Bro, that's not nice. And you know what else is not nice? The fact that you think you could just have your own little vacation getaway place and not even invite me. That's too bad, Sonny. I was just trying to flex on you. Now get out of here. Yo, what's your deal? <laughs> Melon, why? Why? Leave. Leave. You eat all the cake and play bad music. Get out of here. Hey, chill. My music taste is flawless. Guys, I don't understand why Melon's being so mean. It's not like I eat all the cake every day and break watermelons. Oh, wait. <laughs> I do kind of do that, don't I? Anyways, it's still not cool that he ditched me and made his own little vacation house. So now, I'm gonna go visit Quandale and see if he can help me Rank melon just a little bit. Quandale! Quandale Dingleberry! I've got an idea, but I need your help. Yes, what is it, Sonny? So, Melon made this new vacation home so he could get away from me, and it's not very nice. So, I want to set up a little treasure hunt that leads him to a booby trap that'll blow up his new home. All right, I'll help. Yeah? You can help? Oh, that's perfect. I got a bunch of steaks right here. I thought you were a vegetarian or a vegan or something, but yeah, you could enjoy those. Perfect, Quandale. I'll lead him on the trail. And then he'll end up upstairs above your shop where he'll find the diamond TNT. Except it's just a normal TNT. And it'll explode his house. Let's go. Now all I need to do is get Melon's attention. Melon! 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 What do you want, Sonny? <laughs> I knew that would get your attention. Uh, so I feel really bad about you wanting to ditch our house and make your own place on the mountainside. So I did something really nice for you. I made a treasure hunt. Wait, you did? That's so awesome. Okay, where do I start, Shunny? What do I start with? Just inside of our house, I placed the first clue. Wait, no, 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 no. I want it to be in a riddle. Tell me in a riddle. Okay. The house is gray, and inside there's a barrel that's not not gray. Whoa, that is so Ridley. I know, I know. Good luck figuring it out. I think it's in a barrel that's not gray. Something tells me. Well, good luck with that. Okay, okay. Barrel that's not gray. No, not in there. Not in there. Uh, I don't see it anywhere in here, Sonny. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, silly old me. It's, uh, hold on, give me a second. It, yeah, it's, it's right here. Just check the front door. It's right Right there. S Sonny, you just placed this barrel down. This is not a very fun treasure hunt. I don't know, bro. That seemed pretty challenging. Ooh, a book. I wonder where this came from. Search for a tree near the house where a hint of gold may catch your eye. Wait, what? There's a tree near the house with gold? That doesn't make sense. Trees are brown and green. Yeah, but this tree's got a lot of monies in it. It's got that shmoney. That golden shmoney. Is it this tree? No, I would have seen it. Is it this one? Oh, <gasps> Wait, there is gold in this tree. I found it. Wait, what? Is this the prize? Do I just get gold blocks? That's kind of lame. No, no, no. That's only the first step of the treasure hunt. Where do you think the treasure would lie below? Uh, lo below? Below! I found something. Whoa, this is a weird looking chest. Yo, I've got a map. The heck? Bro, X marks the spot. Where the heck is this though? This is so far. Yeah, but the reward will totally totally be worth it. My long journey now commences. Travel the lands. Good luck, Mr. Melon. You must travel far and wide to get the treasure that you desire. I don't know if I'm going the right way. Hey, this actually really isn't even that far. I'm almost there. Just <gasps> right here. I found it. I got a red banner. This is awesome, Sonny. This is the best gift I could have ever asked for. That was a good treasure hunt. Melon, no. Treasure is always beneath the ground. It's never just on top. That was to help mark the location so your small brain could find it. Oh, I understand. Yo, another chest. A book and quill, I see. What does it say? It says, ascend to the heights of Quandale's shop where your quest shall culminate with the discovery of the final chest. Oh. <gasps> 
I gotta go to Quandale's now. You're on the last clue, bro. You're about to get rich. Yes. I'm gonna be so much money. I'm gonna be so much money. And then I'm gonna buy your house and make you homeless. Yes, it's gonna be great. Well, then I'd have a lot of money if you bought it. No, you'd be homeless. I'd buy it from Quandale. Hey, 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 Melon. Hey, Melon. Say it again. No, Sonny, what is wrong with you? Stop this right now or I'll kill you. Okay, I've stopped. Now hurry up and find the last clue. Ascend to the heights of Quandale's. Wait, is it on his shop on top of it or is it like right here? It's on top of it. Spoiler. Oh, it's on, it's on top? Okay, okay. I don't know what was in that chest. That was weird. Okay, just gotta do some parkour. Ow, ow, my ankles. Hey, don't worry. Let me help you with that. There you go. And then it's like boom, bada bing, skadooshki. Oh, is this the final hint? Is this the treasure chest? Whoa, diamond TNT and a book and quill? What does it say? Warning, it must be inside your house to work. <gasps> I'm gonna be so rich. I'm gonna have so many diamonds. This is gonna be awesome. I gotta head to my house now. <laughs> yes, yes. Ow, my ankles. Yes, I made it home. Now all I've gotta do is place my diamond TNT down and pressure plate. And I'm gonna become rich. Rich. Yes! Yes! What the heck? What happened to my house? <laughs> Yo! Melon, you fell for it! Look at your house! Look at your stupid vacation house now! It's made of so many diamonds! Oh, look at his little bellow! Look how rich he is now! What is wrong with you, Sonny? I'm tired of your pranks! That's it! That's it! I'm done with this stupid server! I'm out of here! See you never, Sonny! Wait, wait, Melon, come back! Come back! I'm sorry. Okay, fine. Do you have like my house remade or something? Oh, no, I don't have anything nice for you. I just wanted to tell you, you know how you said I'd be homeless? Now the tables have turned. Let's go. What? That's it. No, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out for good. You'll never see me again. That's it, Sonny. Uh, guys, do you think he's serious? Did Melon really just leave the server? I'm so tired of Sonny always pranking me. Maybe Quandale has some way to help me get him back. I mean, he's the one that always helps Sonny prank me. Quandale, I'm tired of you helping Sonny. This time you're gonna help me. I need to get revenge. Wait, he actually blew up your house? <laughs> Quandale, give me something to prank him or I will kill you. Okay, okay. Go look in the chest and use those items. Wait, this? I looked at this earlier. Whoa, a more per her device. Quandale, I don't think you know how to spell. This is supposed to say more. Potions of invisibility. Yes, I'm gonna find out everything about Sonny. And then I'm I'm gonna prank him in the worst way imaginable. First, I gotta go invisible. Three days later. Oh, it's been so boring without Melon on the server. I haven't seen him in days. I really hope he comes back. Uh, whatever though. At least I still have Quandale. Guys, Sonny doesn't realize I can hear everything he's saying. Hey, Quandale. It's getting kind of boring on this game. Do you have anything fun I can do? Yeah, I actually do, in fact. I have this crazy obstacle course that I need someone to test out for me. Oh, that sounds so fun. Let's do it! Who needs Melon anyways? <laughs> I got Quandale, the real goat. Quandale, I just listened to your whole conversation, and you're gonna do me a favor. You're gonna stay right here, and I'm gonna morph into you. <laughs> He'll have no idea. It's gonna be pretty good, right, Quandale? Yeah, dude, that's gonna be so funny. And it's time to morph. It worked. Look, now I have become Quandale. <laughs> this is perfect. Oh, this obstacle course looks epic. Oh, wait, what? Quandale, what are you doing here? Oh, you want to compete against me? Oh, this is going to be awesome. Quandale, hey, chill. Quandale, you're going down. Do, do, do. Just got to climb up this big old ladder. And then I'm going to have the fastest speed run in Minecraft. Hey, Quandale, you look kind of stupid right now, by the way. You're all red. I think he's embarrassed because he knows he's going to lose. Me? I'm not embarrassed. I'm going to destroy you, Sonny. Yeah, we'll see about that. Let the games begin. Yo, Quandale, chill. Okay, okay. I can do this. I can do this. I'll just break through all the snow blocks, do a little bit of parkour. I can easily win this challenge. Oh, I'm the goat. I'm the goat. Guys, I'm popping off as Quandale, dude. Quandale's OP can one-shot all of these blocks. Oh, I'm so lost. Oh, I'm so lost. What is this maze? Quandale, I just saw him. I just saw him. Get back here. What is is this? Whoa. This place looks crazy. Ah! 
Whoa! I'm on top of the world! And now I can cheese the rest of the levels. Let's go! Goat mode! Wait, no! I went backwards! It's okay. I see the finish line. It's right over there. Come on. I could totally win this. Wait! Quandale! How is Quandale already up there? Guys, I absolutely destroyed Sonny! And now, his ego is demolished. <laughs> Prank number one successful. I don't understand. How do you get through all these obstacles? so much more quickly than me. I was even cheating. Dang you, Quandale. Okay, Quandale, you think you're such a wise guy beating me in the obstacle course. Well, how about let's see who's the fastest on this racetrack. No problem, Sonny. I'll totally destroy you here like all the previous times because I'm the bigger goat. Yeah, we'll see about that. Dibs on the red car over there. Yeah? Let the race begin in three, two, one, go! Oh, yeah, I forgot to start my car. <laughs> <laughs> See ya. No, no. Just three laps to go and I'll be the goat. Guys, I can do this. I just got to cut the corners. I had a bad start. Uh, forgot you had to start the car to actually make it go. Yep, almost one lap completed. I'm zooming in my little box car. Oh, check it out. Shortcut, shortcut. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. No, no, no. This is bad. I just crashed. I just crashed. See you later, loser. Wait, how did Quandale pass me? No, no, no. Get back here. Wait. Quandale is underground right now. This is looking sus. Skirt. Oh, oh, see. No, he just stalled my car. Ha, huh, yes. I use my car stalling device. It's okay. I can still catch him. There's one lap left. Come on. Come on. What the heck? What did he do to me? Ha, 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 ha. I activated my time stopping device. Guys, I'm actually going to win. Final lap. Yes. Sonny losing. He won't know how to control himself. Come on. There's got to be a way I could catch him. Doesn't this thing go any faster? Guys, I'm gonna wait till the last second to cross the finish line. I see him! There's Quandale! I can still win! No! Far worse than me in every single way, Sonny. You can never compete with me. Fine, Quandale. I'll admit it. You're the goat. You win. Okay, guys. Sonny has no idea it was me, but he just called me the goat! Ah. <sighs> I'm out of here, Quandale. You win. The day is yours. And I'm going to go cry myself to sleep over here somewhere. <laughs> Uh, see you later, loser. It's getting a bit dull around here without melon. So it's time to spice up my life. Jetpack engaged. Yes, I'm doing jetpack mining. This is the way of the future. Look at how cool this thing is. Now I just got to find myself some diamonds down here. Ooh, gold. Let's grab this. Yes, I'm literally living in the future. Now where are the diamonds? Even better than diamonds. Rainbow ore! It's so precious and colorful and beautiful. Come to me. I have it. The rainbow god ore. Okay, guys, I used my rainbow god ore to create this god sword and overpowered armor. Now it's time to take on this wretched warden stronghold. This dungeon looks epic! I don't really know why. This little bat's been following me around, too. Oh, but he's so cute. Oh, look at this little guy. Oh, come over here. Oh, give me a little hug. Yeah, so cute. Stupid Sonny. He's trying to hit me and he thinks it's cute, but it really hurts. Now let's see these wardens. Come out and play. You cowards. Where are you? Oh, I hear him. I hear him. Yeah, that was so weird. I'm just going to take these items in the meantime, though. Regen. Ooh, swift sneak. That sounds nice. <gasps> I got my favorite music disc. Cat. Oh, so precious. I don't think Sonny knows knows what he's messing with. Wardens are crazy strong. Oh, that doesn't look good. Let's see. There's gotta be some more loot skis around here somewhere. Uh-oh. That's a lot of noise. He's playing with something he doesn't quite understand. Guys, my game just got really dark. Yo! This place is so cool. Now, where's the chest? I want some loot. <gasps> Another chest! Yes, I need it. Guys, <laughs> There's a giant warden in here. Ew! Go away. You don't want this. You don't want this. Die! Oh, I'm so strong. I'm actually OP. Let me eat an apple. Wait, there's more. What the heck? Where'd these guys come from? Die! 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 <sighs> there's so many. What is this place? It's so cursed. It's so cursed. I just wanted the chest loot. Uh, guys, there's so many wardens. What is happening? This isn't some normal ancient city. This is insane. Ha <sighs> 
<laughs> Get me out! No way! I got obliterated! <laughs> <laughs> Look at Sonny. He got destroyed. I should probably get out of here, though. This is really scary. Uh, guys, I don't think I want to mess with those wardens anymore. It cost me my life. I want to do something more peaceful. I'm thinking I build myself a classic. Something that Melon and I used to love doing together. A nice big water slide. And I think I have just the spot for it. Right here. It's Perfect! Yes! Now all I gotta do is go down the water slide and it's gonna be so much fun! Guys, look at this awesome water slide Sunny made for me. It's time to become a fish. Alakazama kazoo! Oh, guys, I'm a literal slamming right now. This is so weird. Just a slamming, doing slamming things. And I'm almost at the top of the water slide. I can't wait to ride this. It's gonna be just like the good old days. Ah, it's perfect. Now I just gotta grab a boat and go for the ride of my life. This is gonna be so awesome. Wait, why is there a salmon up here? It just stole my boat! What the heck? Get back here! I have never seen something so cursed in all of Minecraft. Guys, I just stole his boat as a salmon. What is happening? Ah! That's it. I'm grabbing another boat. This is so glitchy. It's time to ride out. Whoa! Ah! I'm losing control! <sighs> Guys, I barely survived that. Why is there a floating salmon? Am I imagining this? I feel like I hit my head really hard on the way down or something. I swear a salmon just flew past me. Eh, it was probably nothing. Guys, I actually really miss Melon. Minecraft just isn't the same without him. Quandale, please. I really need your help. This is serious. Melon quit the server and he hasn't come back. I need to do something special in order to make him relog. Well, if he's so upset with you, why don't you make him something special? Like a nice melon-themed build, you know? Quandale, you're a genius. There's just one problem. I'm really bad at building. Wait, you have a solution? Yeah, it's called the Dream Build TNT. When you light it up, it can create anything you want. Quandale, you're my hero. Melon's gonna be back in no time. Dream Build TNT and a flint inch deal for me. If I'm gonna win Melon back, I have to use this Dream Build TNT at a place of significance. A place that can show my sincerity to Melon. A place at which I once destroyed his melon house, his cottage on the mountaintop. I will now build the ultimate melon shrine in his honor. And then hopefully he'll come back to the server. So let's just place it right here. Get the flint and steel and light it up. It worked. It's perfect. There's no way Melon will still be upset with me. I've created the ultimate melon farm. The view from up here is beautiful. You can see our house. You can see the flying salmon. I really must have hit my head super hard when I fell off that water slide. Ah! Wait, Melon! Yeah, Sonny, I gotta tell you something. I never left. I really appreciate this build you made for me. I just wish, uh, there was one thing different about it. You weren't on it! Ow, chill! Melon, you could have killed me! I have one heart left! It's time for you to leave the server. Wait, what are you holding, Melon? <laughs> Get wrecked! Now I have an even more awesome home. Yo, I can't press respond! What's going on? My game crashed! Yes! The server's all mine! And that subscribe button should be all yours. Click it right now!